Hello everyone, this is Mr. Chess at Chess Lovers Only, providing you with some entertaining chess content. Today I've heard a lot about the cat AIs on chess.com and I'm going to play one of them today. If you don't know, chess.com has released some new AIs which are cats you can verse against. There are there's different levels, so there's scaredy cat, angry cat, Mr. Grumpers, and Cats Perov, but there's an interesting cat called Mittens and it has a mysterious rating of only one. Look at this cute kitten. Mittens likes chess, but how good is she? Well, we're going to find out today. So let's have a look. I'm playing as black. E4, I play the accelerated dragon in a Sicilian and I have no idea what this is. It goes out of all the things that I know, but if he plays that, actually I can't even play my usual dragon, because if I do that, or I don't know, I have no idea what it's doing, but, so, let's see if I can play, it's playing like a Fiench, Fienchetto plus a Rosalimo. Which is completely out, like outside what I know at all. I haven't actually, I don't actually know the theory of Rosalimo yet, unfortunately. Really, I just want a castle, don't I? Um, sure, why not? Protecting the pawn, getting out of the pin. Now I still can't fin keto. Should I fin keto or should I put, go this way? I think this way, just to be safe, is better. Striking in the center. So if I do stuff here. We're gonna take with the knight, isn't it? Let's just castle, get out of it. Attack in my center. Maybe I should have pushed this pawn because now there's gonna be stuff on the this file exactly. Let's get out of the pin. And let's block. Block the file. There's another bishop staring at the pawn. That's. I want to get rid of this bishop because the pin is really annoying. I mean, I'd love to have my bishop on this diagonal. Oh, it's sacrificing. Oh, because it's got a fork in the end. Well, that lasted very long, didn't it? Okay, it's got a fork. It's trying to kill me already. Protecting. Oh, but I had. No, and I had the knight taken back as well. Let's just plug everything. Plug it there and get my bishop on the long diagonal. Right, I was lucky for him. Threatening in checkmate. Could have taken a nine. I was thinking what I could have done to get out of that. But if I do this, now it's got a little dark square, isn't it? But there's no other move, essentially. So it has a fantastic center, trying to kill me, protecting the knight, let's undermine it, undermining the knight. Uh, that was smart by that. What happened there? Oh yeah, 
because the bishop was undefended after that. So it's up. It's up a piece now. It's up a piece plus. How's it going to protect the bishop? I mean, it's going to take this pawn on me, which really sucks. If I take the bishop, it takes my rook with check, and then I can do like crazy stuff on the diagonal. What if I just try to go in here? It's probably going to checkmate me. Exactly. Should I have gone picking up pawn? Go back? Obviously, I have to go back. It's going to probably push, no? Or that. Okay, it's seriously smashing me now. Is there some. It's probably gonna be. There's gonna be a checkmate somewhere. Can't go into this file. Let's see if I can do this. The bishop's still hanging. Just want to trade off the queen. Trying to protect. There's no point sacking, right? If I do it, it's just nothing. Trade off the queen, and the back rank's pretty weak. Um, whoops. Haha! <laughs> just sack it. That's still checkmate. It's aiming the rook. There's a fork still. The rook and then take my queen, right? Okay, sure. Um, let's check me there. There's the book coming in as well. I mean, that's gonna be checked me. Well. Meow, I like chess. He he he. Okay, let's play e4. Let's see what it wants to do here. Oh, it plays the ceiling. Let's just go. I've been playing Smith Moore mainly, but I don't know the theory pass like the first couple of moves. And I've been playing Alapin. So let's see how it knows the Alapin. It's playing this line. This line that you push. Then you play this, it takes, and then you take. And then there's some stuff on the diagonal with the queen. Attacking the center straight away. Could take here. Or could do that. Yeah, okay. That was a mistake. Straight away or not? Takes, takes, and then I can take back. That's fine. No, it's not because in the end, in the end, there's a fork. But I just do this in the end, isn't it? Which protects the rook, which is very good. But I'm losing like all my pawns. Exactly. Okay. So what do I do? It's gonna take this. It can't take. I want a castle.
I mean, it's tough, isn't it? Putting that queen there, then bishop there. I mean, this... This is a queen trade then, right? And then try and castle by hand. Or not. Wow. So now I'm stuck in the middle. Essentially. I want the castle by hand, it stopped me already. I mean, I want to just put the bishop in the castle. And it's, in, it's probably pretty much impossible for me to get rid of that bishop. I have no pawns or light square bishop in my knights all the way over here. Is this going to castle? Is there a way to block it with the knight? I mean, I don't know. My king's stuck in the center. Wow. What is the king doing? What is the king doing? Let's try and push. And now... Let's get our knight in. Or the rook in. The rook in I'll have to trade and then I'll have to open fire which might be a bit difficult. That wasn't very good. Ah, uh, okay. That was a bad move by me. One my knight. This bishop is really annoying. Let's try and stack. I have no covered all these squares with its bishops. Let's protect the pawn. It's just gonna come in and kill me. I am. Uh, Covered the pawn anyway. Um, I'm screwed right now. There's probably a million ways they can win now. It's covering all these squares. I can't stack my rooks anywhere. Taking the pawns. Or, or that, which I saw before. Let's try and stalemate. I wonder if Mittens was really like... Is this checkmate? Yeah. Well, really loves his bishops, doesn't it? It looks like I won. He he he. Sorry Mittens, I wasn't really even listening to your speech but you look so cute you should have a try too and let me know how you go and you should consider subscribing if you want some more entertaining chess content and i'll see you in the next video see you bye bye <laughs>